If you don't know how to burl them shrimp with that crawfish, don't try it. You better get a lot of pot of meat, dude. I've been to two barrels, they brucheed the shrimp with the crawfish. You couldn't peel them with a bulldozer, dude. I'm about to learn you one last time. Let's get it. Well, save my pot of meat, dude. If you order from KJ Crawfish next couple of days and you get this in your box, tag us, contact us, let us know. We got a free gift for you, dude. It's gonna look just like that in your box. Stale Crackers Family Cookbook. It's gonna be money, dude. We might even send you some free crawfish on me. So as I travel around, a lot of people say, dude, your method of shrimp, that peel works. Some people are like, man, I couldn't get it right. It comes down to a good cooker that can come right back to a burrow really quick, cook them shrimps, boom, kill a burrow. I think a lot of times they throw the shrimps in there and they waiting and they waiting. Next thing you know, it's four minutes for them shrimps been cooking the whole time. Let's get it right now. All we got there is water, no seasoning, nothing. Very important, get your pot to that. How does it can go? Dump your beautiful shrimps in there. Stir it 60 seconds. 60 seconds, nothing but water. We're gonna make that shrimp pop out that shell. it off just like that let them cool dude pull them out dude get them in a little basket and forget about them go ahead and get on your crawfish now burl your crawfish just like you know how just keep burling them nothing special we're gonna get this and we're gonna let that cool down dude now burl your crawfish like you normally do dude put your Oh, I wish they'll yeah, let me release this. They're holding me up on my signature ball, dude. Get you a good bit in there like that. Check this P-Rog out. I got a whole P-Rog of goodness right here. I'm not even gonna name all that. Got the Holy Trinity, got the potatoes, add them in there like that. Boom, get that out of here. This is optional. This is my signature move. Them gallon of pickled jalapenos. Get them in there. It won't make it no hotter, just give it that little flavor, dude. The main question I get, dude, is what I do with them crawfish when they get delivered to my house from Cajun Crawfish. Get cold beer, invite your friends, have a party, dude. I'm just messing. You get your crawfish in. If you're going to burl them that day, take the crawfish out, wash them off, and burl them. If you're going to burl them the next day, take the lid off. Get all the stuff out. Leave the crawfish in there. Let them breathe, dude. The next day, right before you ball, you wash your crawfish, and then you get your burl on, dude. Check out the beautiful crawfish we caught this morning. Oh, no, Fruge egg hooked me up again, dude. Cajun crawfish for the win. That money, dude. Now, Cajun crawfish, we triple quadruple wash. You still need to wash your crawfish, dude. Check these things out. Look how pretty. Oh, dude. Check those out right here, dude. Monsters. Cool. All alive, ready to get burled, dude. Ay -ay -ay. Let's wash them. This ain't too bad right here, dude. We got three floaters, three dead ones. They got to come out, dude. Boom, boom. Look how clean that water is. But look, we triple wash them over that Cajun crawfish. You need to wash your own crawfish, dude. But check this out. Same pond. We got them crawfish at, we got the whiskey, we got the vodka, dude. That's a full circle of life. <laughs> Let's get it. A lot of people ask me, how long you burl the vegetables? I'm not worried about none of that. I go off the potatoes. When the potatoes are al dente, that's when you move to the crawfish. Oh, you thought I forgot them lemons, dude? Get that in there. The more potatoes are about right, dude. Drop them old hot dogs in that old smoked sausage. We got that to a rolling ball. Let's add them beautiful thing in profit. Sink them down. Only about 
two or three minutes on my crawfish. I don't overburn them, dude. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look how pretty. minutes dude we're gonna kill that ball look at all that frozen corn a couple champions in there don't ever overcook your mushroom dude get that in there get that out of there get that stir on dude now we're gonna let them soak don't worry them shrimps are still doing good that t boy look how pretty that is get it up in there oh, look the color on that look how red that is Check that out, dude. We got the crawfish in that soak mode right there. Time to add them beautiful shrimps right back. No season on it. We're about to hit that. Two things that smell like shrimp. One is shrimp. Soak them down in there, dude. Now, you're going to let that soak. You're going to keep tasting and tasting every five minutes to the how you like. They're going to soak up that season on. Come right out them shells, dude. Look how pretty that ball is. Come on. Get up in there. You got that corn, you got them jalapenos, you got them old hot dogs. Been about 15 minutes, dude. Look at all that. It done soaked up all that juice. It done went down to the bottom. Let's pull them up and we're gonna chop that, dude. Boom, let that drain. Let's get our dump on, dude. Check that out right here. Lay that down. Yeah. That's a burl, dude. Shrimp that peel with the crawfish. Let's get one of them shrimps a run, dude. Pull it right there. Comes apart. Flip flop. We don't stop. Right there. That's money. Put that on the money dip on a cracker, dude. Soft head bone. What about them crawfish, though? Check that out. Boom. Right out the shell. Wash it down with a headshot, dude. Another one. Slamming crawfish. My favorite thing to do all together with crawfish, I get three tails, peel that like that. They come right out them shells just like that. I take three crawfish tails. I put them on a cracker, dude, in the money dip. Out there, boom. Lights out. Thank you for joining us. I appreciate y'all. Now that money, dude.